So tonight is just one of those hamburger helper nights. So we're having hamburger helper. Um, what I do, it's a chicken hamburger helper, but it's the same thing as the ground beef hamburger helper. So I just take the chicken out and put the fried rice. Um, and we'll probably have some vegetables or fruit, but that's it cooking right there. So here's dinner all plated up, some fried rice and pineapple. A true Monday night dinner. Until next time, guys. Happy dining. So tonight we have some taco soup. And let me tell you, this is some of the best beef broth i get this at the dollar tree and it's got like 32 fluid ounces big for a dollar but we are having taco soup um i just put this together it's got some ground beef some corn onions diced tomatoes um some black beans pinto beans did i say corns already i might have but doesn't that look good oh my god it's a baseball night so i'm gonna put this on and let it cook for about two hours and we'll see what it looks like when we get back, guys. We're back from baseball practice, and the soup is done. Does that not look delicious? Here's my soup all bowled up. Let's put some chips up in this bad boy. Oh, my God, is that not looking delicious? And what are one of my meals without a little sprinkled cheese? Tell me that's been looking good. And a dollop of <laughs> a sour cream. And let me ask you, do y'all do this too? Growing up, we always had our meals at the table. This is the only time that we get to like calm down, talk about the day, you know, and just figure out what's going on in each other's life. This is something my parents always insisted that we do. And to this day, I still do it. You know, the world is a busy place and we have to make time where we can fit in time. So tell everybody good eating. Good eating. <laughs> so tonight we're going to have some Philly cheese steaks. I've got some bell peppers and some onions, and I got them in a little olive oil, and I'm going to sweat them out, and then I'm going to put in my Philly cheesesteak meat and cook that up, so we're going to saute this out, and then we'll go to the saute it out, sweat it out, going to sound like Richard Simmons, sweat it out, sweat it out, anyways, you got to make cooking fun. I'm going to sweat these out, saute them, whatever you want to call them, and then we'll add the meat. So let me finish this up. So I just put the steak of meat on top of my bell peppers, and I'm going to cook that up. It is so hard to cook with one hand. Ugh. And I just soften that out and cook it, and then you end up with this, like, yummy meat. Look, does that not look delicious? Got some fries going. This is going to be a good one, y'all. Okay, so finally done. This is what's for dinner. Look at that Philly, uh, Philly cheesesteak. Like, here is a close view. Does that not look delicious? And look at those fries. Somebody said, sure is a lot of cheese, but we're a southern family, and we love cheese. So just judge me. It's okay. I'm not mad. Anyways, guys, that's what's for dinner tonight. Until next time. Guys, what do you have cooking tonight? I have some red beans. It's got some onions, some bell peppers, some other seasons in there. Um, and it's just cooking down. I have some rice going with some butter and some saffron and some other yummy stuff. I've got my pan getting hot because I'm going to batter me up some pork chops and fry them. And I'm normally not a fried food eater, but <sighs> damn you, YouTube. So here is dinner all plated up. I've got my beans, my rice, and my pork chops. So there it is, and that's what's for dinner tonight, guys. So guys, here it is all plated up. Some yummy spaghetti and meatballs, side salad, and a toast. I hope you're having a good night. Bye, guys.